Hello friends, welcome to another chest opening video. My, uh, my name is Sunspan. Uh, I'm getting over a cold, which seems to happen every single time I go to a LAN, so I guess I have a weak immune system. I really don't know. It ha might have something to do with me never leaving the house, so for any of you guys that uh, or gals that have the same lifestyle as me, which is basically never leaving the house, uh, probably a good idea to do that every once in a while. So we have a couple of chests to open since I have been gone. Um, been catching up on a lot of stuff and there's been a couple chests that have come out. So we have the Treasure of the Dreamer's Flame which just came out today. Uh, when you guys watch this it'll be yesterday. And then the Treasure of the Grim Sneer's Stash. One of the worst name. God, my nose is killing me. I'm going to try not to sneeze. Uh, treasure of the Grim Near Stash, which is one of the worst names for a treasure, but pretty good one. This was I came out like five days ago or something like that while I was at the summit. Uh, so let's take a gander. So the one that came out today, if we peek inside, uh, I'm not a hundred percent sure this could be related to Dream League. Right now it's not, according to the Dota 2 store, but it might be a bug. So I'm not sure about that. Uh, we have four rares and then a mythical. So the first rare is the Sizzling Charge for Storm Spirit. Alright, very nice. Kind of reminds me of that Wraith King set that has a big face in the middle. Uh, we have the Vindictive Protector set for Magnus. That's pretty. I like the hair on that one. He's got some pretty locks. The Splintering Awe set for Treant. This is like a... I don't know some native not native american like ancient like mayan i don't know if it's mayan but something can you guys tell how i sound i i've been told by everybody this is how i normally sound i'm like i can hear myself right now it sounds horrible but if that's the way you hear me normally then god be with us all and then the last set is wyvern skin which is a rare drow set this was made by anuxi if i do believe uh and then, of course, the very rare, which I'm really hoping we get because this set is fucking awesome, is the Shooting Star set for Sniper. I can't remember exactly who made that. I believe Bronto Thunder, Danny Dem. There might have been more people. Uh, this was a set that was originally introduced for the Dream League uh, season last year, but didn't get in in time, so I thought it was going to get in for this year. That's why I'm thinking this might be related to Dream League, but I'm not sure. Either way, this set is godly, but... The thing to remember about this set is that it did have a bunch of particles, which, as far as I can tell, did not make it in the game. Uh, as you can see in the bottom here, it says, including just loading screen. So that's a little unfortunate, but the set still is pretty sick. All right, let's open them, see if we get the very rare. Got the Magnus. Uh, there's no countdown. This is so odd. I kind of prefer this. This is nice. Oh, come on. Give me the sniper set. Damn it. Not a sniper picker. Alright. And then the other chest is the Treasure of the Grim Sears. I don't know where they got this name from, but good God, man. You can think of better names than that. The sets, though, I think this set, or this chest has better sets. Um, they are all rare. And then the weird thing is the very rare is just there's nothing there. It's just a chance to get a courier, I guess. This is like the old school way to do it. So remember the last chest uh, had four sets and then a very rare, which is an actual set. This one has five sets that you're definitely going to get. And who knows what that is. Uh, the first set is the Garb of the Frost Lord for Lich. Uh, I believe this has something to do with Pyrian Flax. Um, I could be wrong. I do know that it's also made by Chemical Ali and Dry, who work with us a lot. In fact, they have three sets in this chest, which is insane. Oh, I should mention, this uh, This chest does contribute to, I believe, MLG. Don't quote me. Um, pretty sure, I know it contributes to something. I'm pretty sure it's MLG, though. The second set is the Wraps of the Winter Bringer for Crystal Maiden. This is another Chemical Aaliyah and Dry set. We have the Covert Saboteur for Ricky. The Stump Grinder for Timbersaw. That one's pretty cool. And the Ember Bark 
set for Treant, which is another set by Chemical Aaliyah and Dry, and I have to say, easily, easily the best Treant set to come to the store. Excuse me. Ugh. Ah. I've gotten past the really annoying one. Well, I've gotten past the contagious stage of the cold, but now it's just like the disgusting, got to get rid of everything stage. And that's how I'm struggling to make this very simple video. Is that right, Mucky? Hey. All right, she's not having any of it. Let's open. All right. I don't know who changed this no countdown thing, but it's way better. I just want the Treant set. I know I'm going to get it. There we go. Such a good set. All right. We got everything. Pyrian Flax. I'm pretty sure this is Pyrian Flax's Lich. It'll be pretty embarrassing if it's not, but... Uh, I mean, it has, like, the Skeleton King crown, so I think it, it's fitting either way. All right. So that is the two chests. There is another one. Um... How do I say this? There's a third chest that I don't want to buy because it's wards. Is that wrong? I don't know. It just seems like... I don't even know what to say. Like, I guess I can show it to you guys. I don't want to buy this chest, though. It's one of the first... It's a common, so I guess that makes sense. But it's just a bunch of wards. And this one contributes to ESL. So if you want to contribute to ESL in some way, this is a good way to do it. These will just be stuck in my inventory personally. Like these are this is stuff I would never use. Since as you guys know from A to Z, I don't ward typically. I'm a very selfish player and I'm a piece of garbage. So Alright, that is it. Hope you guys enjoyed this double trouble version of uh the chest opening. Uh hopefully we'll see you guys soon. Until next time. Have have a good one, friends. Next time you hear me, hopefully I won't be so nasally nasally nasal